2024 came to an end and what a match it has been for Morbid and Sporting. The first half uh, was keenly contested with uh, Morbid and Sporting and uh, Worry, both teams having their opportunities. But then it became all uh, Morbid and Sporting. Ultimately turned out to be a lopsided match. But look at these opportunities uh, from both Morbid and Sporting and Uari. It was keenly contested, isn't it, Leon? Uh, uh, Leon. Uh, look at that. Look at that move once again from Morbid and Sporting. They got opportunities, uh, Galore, in the first half. So did Uari. I think the first half was pretty evenly matched. With both teams showing a lot of intent and a lot of great chances for Wari AC as well. I think they could have converted them in the first half itself and not waited for the second half. But I think that uh, it was quite evenly contested. Now in the second half, I think there was a huge difference in attitude. And that's another chance from Wari AC. And quite a few chances where Wari could have converted. And many chances for Mohammedan as well, but mostly off target. And this was the chance to change the game, to change the rhythm from Sajjal Bagh, taking them 1-0 ahead before entering the dressing room for the first time. So that changed the complexion of the match uh, for sure. Sajjal Bagh's first goal and that uh, brought a lot of uh, confidence, instilled confidence uh, among the young players of Morbid Sporting and this uh, is how the, Morbid, the second half began and Morbid Sporting stayed away showing intent of going all out and this is uh, a good opportunity for Israfil and uh, he did have opportunities galore but just couldn't uh, score the goal and look at uh, another opportunity another shot on target from Israfil well, although, uh, look at that again, a lot of chances, somehow he could not score. Yes, Israfil getting 9 shots. That's almost a third of the shots taken by <laughs> Mohammed Sporting alone. And just unfortunately couldn't get on the score sheet. But again, Sajal Bagh with the second goal of the game. And what a strike from distance. What a finish. And this is where Wari AC knew that they were in for a lot of trouble. Look at that shot, a long ranger, wonderful shot. Wari still created a few opportunities but uh, could not uh, manage to convert them. And once again, that was Israfil. Once again, he tried his level best but just did not find the target and did not find the back of the net. But he has done the hard work, he has done everything possible except scoring. Although he did not score, his teammates scored. To look at that uh, attack again. So, Mohammed Sporting initially in the first half, particularly, were very vibrant to the left and then to the right. And this was the third goal scored from the right. That was once again Israfil. But uh, look at that uh, shot, look at that uh, score, look at that goal. The technique was just sublime. That's an individual finish, the individual quality. And again, Israfil just going wide. This boy did everything right. Everything. With the ball, he was fabulous. Without the ball, he was fabulous. His work rate was great, but just couldn't finish. Another chance for the substitute. Keeping the goalkeeper very busy today. Creating a lot of chances from their set pieces. Even scoring from a set piece, in fact. And I think the substitute that came on had an immediate impact on the game and what a finish. Yes, Addison Swin finishing it uh, in style after Ashley Coley hit that uh, shot and found uh, the back of the net almost from a similar position and this was a terrific goal. Another substitute and that is uh, Lalton Kima who went past uh, as many as three defenders and scored that goal. Look at that from a different angle. Everything was right, including the placement, the finish. And this team lacked finish. Look at that. It should have been scored. But then Mohamed Sporting carried on scoring. 
and that is uh, the substitute who scored yet again Lalton Kima that was a fabulous set piece it was worked on maybe a thousand times on the training ground and it just worked out perfectly and I think that was a beautiful way to end the game six goals to nil in favor of Mormon Sporting <laughs>